Hello guys, Omni here. If you're new to the channel, then you should know that I am a huge Star Wars fan. If you've been on the channel for a while now, you probably already know that by now. I grew up with the original trilogy. I, I even like the prequels despite their flaws. And despite some of the choices here in the recent films, I still enjoy them and I still love the universe and the world of Star Wars. And one thing, even from the original trilogy that never really one of the few things I think from the original trilogy that I still feel kind of doesn't hold up, at least when you look at the series as a whole, is the the initial fight between Obi-Wan and Darth Vader. And even in the remaster, they did try to spice that up. They increased like the 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 they increased the frame rate uh, in that fight to kind of give the the fight a little bit of a faster pace. They tried to tweak and fix the lightsabers and you know, unfortunately at the time, I feel like the, a lot of people have the preconception that that fight was underwhelming and Obi-Wan lost because of his age. When in reality, and Rebels even shows this too, that he is at the height of his power. Obi-Wan has never been more powerful. The only thing is it was, this was the first Star Wars film. It was a limitation of the way that it was shot and the way it was made and the people involved at the time and the techniques at the time. I'm sure played a big part in that. Um, as we see in Rebels, like I said, Obi-Wan in his old age is still a force to be reckoned with. He defeats Darth Maul in three slices. And uh, let me rephrase that. Three strokes. That duel lasted three strokes of his lightsaber. And we even see in Rogue One, when Darth Vader is assaulting the rebel forces at the end, trying to get the Death Star plans back. That hallway scene is one of the most intense and adrenaline fueling scenes I've seen in film, period. And he was not hindered by his cybernetics. He was not hindered by being a charred, broiled old man. He was a force to be reckoned with. And if you want to take it even farther, check out the Vader comics. Those things are ridiculous. So what I what what's been floating around today and what prompted this video I've seen some other people reacting to it, um, and I wanted to check this out myself. Like I said, I love me some Star Wars, and a channel on YouTube called Fix It In Post has reimagined this scene, and I've been seeing a lot of people talking and praising, singing the praises of this video, and I wanted to watch this with you guys, share this with you all, and see how this plays out. So I'm going to go ahead and we're going to pull this up, and I'm going to link their channel in the description uh, so please, if you enjoy this, if you like this, go support this, watch the original one so you can see this in its full big screen glory than the little tiny window I've got here, uh, because it, from what I've heard, it deserves it. So let's see, let's see if it lives up. That's no more. It's a space station. <clears throat> Okay. Ah, okay. We're there interlacing in their new stuff with the actual original footage. That's nice. A way to blend it in. Oh, okay. Oh, there's they. It looks like they superimposed the like Allegheny's face onto whoever they have under the hood. So they didn't go with like a look-alike or something. That's interesting. Even the lightsabers here already looks way better than the in the original one. Like you can tell this is a fresh scene and some of these angles though. But it looks great. All right, all right, all right. The circle is now complete. When I left you, I was but the learner. 
Now I am the master. Only a master of evil does. Oh, snap. Your power is a weak old man. Oh, <laughs> can't win, Darth. If you strike me down, I shall become more powerful than you can possibly imagine. Then I will show you the true nature of the Force. Oh, okay. Oh, he's on fire! Dude, this is some solid choreography. Holy crap. I love the sound design on these hits. There she is. Dude, the impact, like just the the sound of the sabers hitting, you feel like the force. You hear it. And the sound design in this, man. Okay. Certainly has courage. Good will do us if he gets himself killed. God. I, I love this movie. Oh, dude, holy. There is no escape. Oh, shoot. Dude, this is. Oh, that was awesome, but he could have just threw it right at him. Didn't we just leave this party? Uh... What kept you? We are running some old friends. Is the ship all right? Seems okay if we can get to it. Just hope the old man got the tractor beam out of commission. Yeah, he's, he's, he, yeah he, he did. He's working on it. Well... Oh, that little, like, overhead, man. Oh. Okay, that was a little, but still. Now I'm getting emotional. Now you will die. That was, here we go. There you go, logo. That's a nice logo too. Like I said, I'm gonna link their channel and the original video in the description. And please, anybody that watches this, I want, you need to watch it. If this, this, if you've, if watching it here was your first time seeing it, you're doing yourself a disservice. I, you need to go watch this yourself full screened and like the crap out of this video. This was some amazing FX work, amazing choreography. 
Like, I think the only thing that didn't really, that was a little wonky to me in the whole thing is, I mean, the facial tracking is a little off in some scenes, but still the amount of time and uh, effects that it would take just to get that to match up is astounding. The fact that it looks that good is a testament to these guys' skill. I, I don't know the people themselves behind this that make it. So, you know, good, good freaking job. This was awesome. The, the, everybody involved that made this happen. This is, this was great. The only, uh, the only other thing that I was like a little off, like I was, I, I kind of got lost in my thought there cause distracted by like how overwhelmed I am with how just well done this was made was just the moment where Obi-Wan pushed, uh, Vader back, looked a little weird. Uh, when, when Vader pushed Obi-Wan, I thought that looked great, but whoever either designed the choreography or the people doing it, don't actually physically doing the choreography in this freaking hell. Yeah, man. Oh my gosh. That gave me a rush. That was so exciting to watch. Um, yeah, please go support these guys. Go check this video out yourself. Go like the crap out of this video. Subscribe to these guys, man. I, I'm I want to go check out some of their other stuff. Unfortunately, I'm going away for this weekend. I won't be back uh, until Sunday night. So hopefully, nothing too crazy drops. My my Detective Pikachu uh, review is going to be delayed uh, because of that. Because unfortunately, I don't have any mobile equipment that I can take to do this. Uh, at least to the quality that I would like. Um, I wouldn't be able to edit anything. I would have to pretty much do everything from my phone because my laptop can't do crap. Uh, so I'm, if I'm without my desktop computer, I'm they're pretty, at a, pretty much at a loss. <laughs> but man, I, I love this. Uh, this has been a great year for Star Wars for me. Uh, from everything we got at Celebration everything we've heard uh especially with the disney schedule coming out with what happens post rise of skywalker um we won't get another star wars film until one after rise of skywalker we won't get another star wars film until 2022 2022 and then from there it's every two years so they're really they really did scale back on what they were doing at least as far as theatrical releases are concerned um, which I don't know how I completely feel about that, but we'll, we'll see. We'll see what they have in the lineup. I really hope that we got some Knights of the Old Republic coming, but anyway, guys, I'm going to pass this off to you guys. What did you think about this? Are there any other fights, whether it be Star Wars or any other franchise that, you know, something from an older film that, you know, it could use a little bit of a modern taste on, a uh, some combat. Let me know uh, your ideas, your thoughts, your feelings on this down in the comments below. And like I said, please watch this yourself in full detailed glory and like these guys' video. Like that video. Share that video. They they, des they deserve every view that this, this video gets. Not this video, their video. Screw my video, go watch their stuff. Anyway, guys. That's it for today. I'll see you guys when I get back and uh, I'll hopefully have my Detective Pikachu review ready for you guys Sunday night. So thank you, everybody. You all take care.